بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم اللہ صلی اللہ محمد و علیہ السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ٹو یو دا ویو ویلکم ٹو آور سیریز آن میرج ان آل کمیونٹیز ٹوڈے ڈیوس از فائلنگ آؤٹ آف کنٹرول اینڈ ان دس سیریز وی پٹ میرج اینڈ ڈیوس انڈر دا اسپاٹ لائٹ سو دیٹ کپلس کو لرن سم ویلیوبل لیسنس اینڈ وی ہوپ اینڈ پلے دیٹ دس انفارمیشن ہیلپس یو ٹو میک اے سکسیس آف یور میرج ان شاء اللہ ان دس پارٹ We look at just how important this relationship is. In most religions, marriage is so important and so sacred that there is no such thing as divorce. By sacred, it is meant that it is holy. Holy is something that is associated with God and it is therefore something that we should respect. In Islam too, there are so many teachings that stress the importance of marriage. For example, the Holy Prophet Muhammad ﷺ has said, When a man has married, he has made his religion half perfect and let him fear Allah for the other half. If there is no such thing as divorce in some religions, if marriage is half of faith in Islam, and if it is a topic that is discussed so often in the Holy Quran, then it is a very important part of religion and of life. It is therefore not something that we should treat lightly, but it is something that we should be fully committed towards. Now, let's move on to discuss just how it affects our daily life. Firstly, it is natural for men and women to bond together and marriage is a contract or an agreement between a husband and a wife that ensures that the rights of everyone is protected so that it brings happiness and stability all around. So we must never think that marriage is just about gratifying our lusts because it is so much more than this. As we go along, we will see that there are many rules to marriage in Islam, which if we uphold will bring success and happiness to our marriage. For now, let's move on to discuss its importance. In South Africa today, the trend is that many people do not get married because of the high cost of dowry, and the men folks simply sleep around, fathering many children whom they do not take care of. This single fact is the main cause for the spreading of STDs such as HIV and AIDS and it is for this reason that Sub-Saharan Africa is the capital of the AIDS epidemic. This also results in crime and poverty because the women folk have to take care of the children on a maid's wage. These children are brought up without the love and care of a complete family. This shows that a loving family and marriage is the basis of a healthy society. More importantly, marriage has a bearing on our spiritual development. The couple has to learn to interact amicably by learning to tolerate, care, respect and finally grow to love one another. Islam and other religions teach that service to God is service to humanity. If we cannot grow to care, respect and love our spouses and children, then we will never grow to care, respect and love our Creator. Marriage is an important part of religion. It is an agreement to protect the rights of all. It is an important basic building block of society. It is a means to improve our spirituality. Now that we know that having a successful marriage is an important part of life, we need to take every step, no matter how difficult it is, to make sure that we have a successful marriage In the next episode, we will try to understand the different personalities of men and women so that we may be able to better get along and have successful marriages. Jazakallah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.